Hey guys, it's Corey and Victoria from Trains of the Valley. And today we're in the warehouse. We got HO Freight and Loco, so let's check it out. Okay, right off the bat, we have a Union Pacific piggyback trailer, a stock car, and then we get into a bunch of different tank cars. Or a couple that I've never seen before, specifically that one, Yukon, Union Carbide. It's an interesting car. Let's see, we have some flat cars, we got the coil car, that's always nice. A couple gondolas, a couple nice ones there. I think this Pennsylvania is a River Rossi, so that's certainly nice. Alright, some various flat cars and miscellaneous cars. Some are just shells. Uh, some some got a little beat up, but some of these cars are really nice too. So we kind of have a bunch in various conditions here. Yep, so some cabooses here. I always like to see this. Some nice covered hoppers. Those are definitely cool. Some small covered hoppers. And a couple open hoppers as well. Alright, we're going to keep moving through it. We got some more stuff to check out so we'll move this stuff and bring some more stuff out we got a bunch of box cars all kinds baby ruth penn central union pacific toys r us santa fe more baby ruth now that's a stock car <laughs> sitting here randomly uh -oh. <laughs> we got illinois central ajax polaroid so a bunch of billboard stuff too in here Old Dutch cleanser. Most of these are in really good condition. Superman, SOS, and some shells. All right, and we got some locomotives. Missouri Pacific Lines, BL2 locomotive. Here's a Lionel, Norfolk and Western, 5710. Rock Island Loco, Canadian National. We have a four-part steam engine here. Here's two cabooses that we have to test out. That's That one is the Searchlight Pennsylvania, and this one has some custom lights installed on the end there. Southern Pacific, we have a trolley. I remember testing this when I bought the collection. It works good, except it's missing a wheel, unfortunately. So, and that, that one's a Bachman. Here's a Tyco Chattanooga. Um, I know it's missing a couple parts, but I have a good feeling that this one's going to work. So we'll test everything in a minute and see how we did. We have a Santa Fe, another Santa Fe, number 350. And here we have an Athern set, A and B unit. These are rubber band drivers, so of course we need new rubber bands here. And to finish off, we have a River Aussie, C and O, number 4012. And if you're seeing this video right now, all these products are available on our website, www.trainsinthevalley.com. You can click the link in the description. Alright guys, that's it for today. I know it was a little brief, but there's been a lot going on lately. Uh, we have a huge update about our mission and the things that are going on with our train shop. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for more collections. I'm pretty sure next time we'll be doing some end scale. Um, and yeah, uh, also I want to mention, check out our website if you weren't on there lately. Not only for these products, but we have been adding a few hundred items every week. Uh, we're collecting items from the shop. We're collecting items from our warehouse. Stuff that um, was on our previous websites that we're now getting transferred onto our new website. So go check it out. We got tons of new items, tons of used items, and that's about it. We'll see you guys next time. All right, bye. bye.